okay guys so welcome back to our 40th php and mysql video tutorial in this video tutorial we are going to use our insertion query and we will insert the values which we'll get from our html form in this case we have same query just the i'm not giving any values here in these two variables instead of this i have a html form a simple form and i will get the values of the name here and the class from this html form and i will insert them in our mysql database table in this case we have a form input type text and i give it a name s name and then input type text name it class and then there is a submit button with the value save so this form i will use with method attribute and go with post and the second attribute will be action and i will type the name of our php file in this case this html form is here form and we want to go with our index.php so in action i will just type index.php so the values goes to index.php when we user will click on submit button so now let's receive those values so i will say is equal to uh, v1 variable will get the value from our first field which is the s name so dollar underscore post sorry capital brackets in single code we'll type the name of those so s name is the name of that first field and then the dollar sign underscore post and the capital brackets then two single quotes then the name of the second field which is the class i think so s name and class so make sure you have typed the correct name s name and class so i will take s class so that to avoid the complications because class is a keyword so maybe this is create a problem so go with s class and so type the correct name here then i'm just i just save the value which will get from this first s class field into v1 and the s sorry s name into v1 and s class into v2 so i'm using those two variable v1 and v2 here for the insertion operation so i will just save this one save my html form here i will just open up localhost dots make sure you type the perfect name and then the form dot html so just click on it and here it is our html form with two fields and say uh, one submit button so first of all i will type a name for example if i want to go with the jennifer for example and the class name would be for i would say m s c physics for example m s c will be capital here but just we are testing so it doesn't really matter m s c physics jennifer so click on save it's saying the connection established insertion successful so i'll go to my php my admin panel i will just refresh my php my admin panel and hopefully our values will come here so here you can see jennifer msc physics so this is the value which we have given to our this form and this form goes to our index.php so index.php receive those you know the values of these two fields in our variable v1 and v2 and we use these two variables already using these two variable in our insertion query and the values of those form provided by user have been successfully inserted in our mysql table here you can see so this is the way that you how we can get the values from our form and insert them in our mysql table so you can use you know there's a little bit different uh, i think so i need to explain that method post and the second way the method is get if you are using the method post here we did not pass anything with our url and all the values go to be encrypted and it's a secure way but if you use the get method then they will be visible in the url 
so it might cause a little bit of problem so it's the best way to go with the post method so that is why i just use the post if you have any problem with regarding this html form you you should go to our html series and first learn those uh, watch those the tutorial of the html forms to better understand the form so this is the way how we can insert the value to our mysql table using our html form so if you have any question regarding this tutorial you are welcome to ask if you like this video please hit the like button if you don't please give us the reason why you don't like it and how we can improve our videos in future so take care of yourself guys and goodbye follow us on youtube facebook twitter google plus visit our website www.sartreviews.com and then go to learn section from menu don't forget to subscribe to our channel to learn more.